So I might be a little late with this video, but whatever. Atlas recently told us that they have 7 announcements for Persona's 25th anniversary. Yes, you heard that correctly, 7 announcements and the first one will come sometime in December, not December, September. And many fans have speculated that it will be related to Persona 4 due to, as you can see here, it being in a similar yellow to Persona 4. Now, is that enough reason for it to be like confirmed or like justified for it for us to think that it's Persona 4? I don't know, but you can see all of this on the 25th anniversary website that I will link down below. The website is in Japanese, so you might have to translate some of the text into English. So if you didn't already know this, but I'm really hyped for one of these announcements being a Persona 6 teaser trailer. More on that later on. Anyway, I'm a huge fan of Persona, and I think the first video I ever uploaded to this channel was about how I got Persona 5 Take Your Heart Edition by Amazon for free. So check that video out. There should be a card popping up right about now, or you can find the link in the description. But now, let's talk Persona 6 and what the other 6 announcements could be. So let's get the obvious one out of the way. So we'll probably get more information on Codename X, which is a mobile game developed by, I think a Chinese mobile game developer that Atlas landed the Persona IP to. The second will most likely be Persona 6. But before you get your hopes up, the announcement will most likely be similar to what we saw when P5 was developed. You know the one with the chair and the chains in the red room, but unlike that teaser, that the real, the release year of the game. I instead think the teaser will show us a coming soon message at the end instead. It will be a very bare bones announcement, but hey, who knows, they might even give us a release window and show us a new IC. I mean, it has been 7 years since the Persona 5 teaser was released, so let's hope. The third I think will happen is the Persona 5 gacha game, because why not? I feel like it's a crazy enough idea that Atlas might do. But before I continue, I just want to say that the 7 announcements doesn't necessarily mean that we will get 7 new games. I just wanted to say that. Now the fourth one I think will be some sort of anime project, and I think it will be a Persona 5 Royal anime. Just like how P4 got Persona 4 Golden animation, so hopefully it's as good as it. Or it could be a Persona 1 and 2 anime series, because I doubt we will get a remake due to how forgotten these games are by Persona fans. So I feel like an anime would be a good way to remind people that there in fact were two more protagonists before Makoto, Yu and Joker. The fifth one, and as much as I want this to be true, it's pretty unlikely due to how busy our system works is right now, and that is Persona 5 Arena, or possibly one with both P3 and P5 characters. The sixth one, uh, I don't know, maybe Persona 5 dating scene? You know, just take the romance section from Inside the Confidence, flesh that out, and make it into a full game. You know what, on second thoughts, I kind of like that idea. I wouldn't mind getting closer with the girls, especially Sai, Makoto, and Hifumi, because if you see that in the video over here, then whew! Then you know what I'm talking about. Especially the way Sai and Hifumi look in those OVAs. <sniffs> Chef's kiss. I totally wouldn't mind having a game with more of that. Now that I'm done fanboying, let's move on to the next one. Number 7. Persona 5 Racing. You heard me correctly. Persona 5 Racing. Mark my word. Watch this space. Nah, I'm just joking. Or am I? So yeah, those are my predictions of what the 7 announcements could be. And I really hope that we can get some substantial info on Persona 6. Even if it's just a little story teaser. That's all I'm asking for. But who am I kidding? We probably won't get that, but a man can dream.